All right, what's up guys, Poison here, and I'm actually in Vallejo right now. I'm gonna try to turn you guys around. Hopefully you guys can see, you know, Six Flags and everything, but... Second. But yeah, I made it to Vallejo. Um, I have work down here in Sonoma for about two days, technically. I'm working tomorrow, Friday, and um, Saturday, and then Sunday, I'm gonna be in San Francisco working for a few other days, let's see, for the last seven days, from Sunday to Sunday, yeah. I'm going to be working in, Valle in San Francisco. Uh, I believe I'm doing concert in the park or something like that. It's going to be a huge event. I'm going to be parking, doing security like I normally do. Um, the trip here to Vallejo wasn't bad. Um, one thing I want to say, though, I had to lower the video quality to 720p because I want to put together the other updates I'm going to do later tonight. Um, unfortunately, on the Note 4, you can't, uh, you can't adjust your video or you can't um, edit your video if it's a 1080p, so you have to do a 720p. But... Right now, I'm just waiting for my cousin and sister to arrive because my cousin's name is the one on the um, on the reservation. Unfortunately, my name isn't on it, so I can't go into the room right now. So I have to wait till he gets here, then I could go inside. But um, yeah, trip here to Vallejo was not bad. It was pretty calm, actually. It was really calm considering the last time I came through Vallejo, and this was Tuesday, mind you. Um, I almost got into two accidents. Yeah, I didn't talk about that at all, actually. I didn't talk about that in... Demons Cross, but, um, sorry, it's just so awkward when people, it's just so awkward when people walk by, give me one second, sorry, I wanted to close the window, but, um, or the windows, because, uh, yeah, I don't want people hearing me, it's kind of awkward, I can't do YouTube in front of people, it's so fucking awkward, but, um, yeah, um, Tuesday when I had to go to the job interview in San Jose, or in Santa Clara, San Jose, um, sorry, the phones, I'm trying to figure out where to put the phone, I'm gonna put it just, uh, sorry, bear with me. Okay, yeah, so, um, Tuesday when I went to San Jose, when we were going through Vacaville here in California, here in, uh, California, I'm moving my chair forward too. Yeah, I had to go through Vacaville, and the cars were, like, bumper-to-bumper -bumper traffic, and I don't think I talked about this on yesterday, but, um, yeah, one part happened where, um, the cars were, like, not bumper-to-bumper, -bumper, but freely, like, they were still traffic, but I was in the left lane, and, um, I was going, like, you know, I was paying attention. The car in front of me wasn't, was going decently fast. I want to say probably 50, you know, considering we were in traffic. Going 50 is pretty fucking excessive. So he's going 50, not paying attention, slams on his brakes. Me all of a fucking sudden. I, like, you know, the dude slammed on his brakes suddenly. I slam on my brakes. Here's one thing about my Volvo. I'm not sure if this is all Volvos, but this is mine. And I actually like this, but on my Volvo, I'm pushing. So let's say I'm pushing, pushing, pushing. Now the brakes are going into effect. So, let's see. Push. Or, let's do it this way. Push, push. Or, push, 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 effect. You have to push a pretty good distance. I personally love that. You know, it doesn't, like, panic brake. But, you know, you have to push out on your brakes. So, me, I slam on my brakes. And I avoid the car. The car behind me fucking barely dodged. Like, the car slams on its brakes. I look at my rear view, full fucking, like, impact, like, shit, I'm about to get hit, my car's fucking done for. I got my car for 1500 So, a uh, 2002 Volvo S60 for 1500 That's extremely fucking good, considering how good the car is. And I'm like, fuck, dude, I just paid off this car, I'm never gonna be able to get this car again. I'm not gonna have money to fix it, because, you know, all my jobs are out of town. I'm not gonna have a right to go work, I'm not gonna have money to fix my car, my car is essentially gone. Luckily, the woman behind me had a shorter car, some, like, Camry or something. She slams in her brakes. I look at my rear view. I see smoke popping out from her tires, like, how hard she hit it. And I see her swerve into, like, the median wall. She didn't hit the wall, thankfully. She braked on time. But if she had not slammed on her brakes and churned, she would have hit me. And at the same time, there's a motorcyclist lane splitting, which is legal here in California. He was lane splitting. And he fucking barely avoided everything. And I'm like, oh, dude. If I would have got hit, yes, I'd been very sad, but you know what? I would have been fine. That's the beauty of Volvos. They're really safe cars. If that motorcyclist had gotten hit, he'd be done for it, honestly. He'd been fucking wrecked. His motorcycle, he would have nothing to do. But, um, yeah, that was on the way to San Jose. Uh, I go to San Jose, everything's going fine. We loop around to Paris to go meet my grandma. Then we loop to, from Paris to Modesto to go meet my sister. And then from Modesto, we go straight home. We had to go up Interstate 80 or Interstate 5. I'm not sure. Um, I know where I'm going. I just don't know the name of the interstate. I know from, like, memory which way to go on the freeway to get home. But, um, 
Uh, sorry, I'm blocking my face. I just noticed that. But yeah, I just know that as long as I'm heading towards Reno, I'm going to get home. That's just the plain fact. But um, yeah, we're going through... We're going through on the uh, on the freeway, and um, there's like three Audis. I want to specify that there's an Audi in front of me, there's an Audi behind me, and there's an Audi to my right. In front of the Audi, there is um, in front of the Audi, there was like a white truck. So the truck ends up slamming on its, or like we went over like you know how you know how freeways have um, up parts and down parts. So we go over an up part. Okay, everything's fine, you know, we're going maybe like 70, you know. We're going like 70, we're going up, and then over the curve, just traffic, like straight up traffic. And I'll talk about that too. Fucking truck slams on its brakes. Audi in front of me slams on its brakes and turns its wheel to the right. Um, there was a big rig over, so it was like a, it was white, white truck, Audi, me. There was a big rig like a way in front of the white truck that was in front of us, or white van. The Audi in front of me slams on its brake, swerves into it. Luckily, there was enough distance in front of him to the big rig that nothing happened. No one crashed. My mom's freaking out because she's in the passenger seat. She wanted to come. She's like, slam on your brakes, slam on your brakes. Turn on your hazard lights. I'm like fucking panicking because every car I've been in, hazard lights are always right here. My car, the hazard lights are right here. This is the hazard lights. So I'm panicky. I'm like, oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck. Where's the hazard lights? I'm slamming on my brakes. Tap them, luckily. And, you know, the car, you know, the car behind me knows, hey, slam on your brakes, there's a hazard. So we're stuck in traffic, 10 minutes, you know, we're driving. And then, um, up ahead, cops, like, undercover cops and one marked unit, like, you know, one typical cop SUV and an unmarked cop car, you know, like, a char not a charger, it's like a challenger, I think, I'm not sure. I don't give a fuck about, like, I don't give a fuck about those type of cars. But it's like a challenger or something, and, like, nothing on it except for, like, in the back rear window, like right up here there was um police lights and some up here fucking cops regular clothes fucking level three ballistic plates that could stop like an ak if they wanted to fucking all these cops are around the car around this car pulling the guy over and they're all their hands are on their guns and i'm like okay something's up here that's not fucking normal one there wouldn't why would these cops need level three ballistic armor like these were like ar 500 thin you know, metal ballistic plates. I'm like, these fucking cops are definitely after this guy for a reason, especially because they have their hands on their guns. They're like, dude, they're not fucking around. If something happens, pull it out and they're going to shoot. Simple as that. And I'm just thinking, you know what? I'm getting the fuck out of here. I'm like, I'm getting the fuck out of here as far away as I can. Because if that car pulls out and they try to shoot at it, I don't want my car getting hit. Two, I don't want to be anywhere near it if the guy decides to run off and ends up hitting me. I don't want that shit. So I'm like, you know what? I'm gone. So that was Tuesday. We get home safely. We're just like, okay, we're done for the day. We ain't doing shit anymore. We're fucking done. Uh, yesterday, Wednesday, um, didn't do shit, honestly. Wednesday was spent packing, literally. And watching Oran High School Host Club. Pretty good anime. I actually do enjoy it. It's pretty funny. Um, kind of gay. Kind of gay, but it's a really funny show. Um, but yeah, now I'm just here in Vallejo. Uh, let's see. I left at... I left at 6, actually, and it's already 7.40, so, and I've been sitting here for 10 minutes, so, 18 minutes, actually, I was sitting 10 minutes in the parking lot, and around 8 minutes and 49 seconds here, so, I'm, like, 18 minutes here, um, my sister texted me that her and my cousin are 30 minutes away, they haven't pulled into the place yet, because I'm facing directly, if they were to pull in, I could see them, but, yeah, I'm just waiting here, um, honestly, we only have, like, 20 minutes ago Six Flags. I think Six Flags here closes at 9 or 8. Um, I'm not sure, but they wanted to come early to go to Six Flags. They're not fucking here early. They were supposed to leave at 5. They didn't leave till 6. They're not getting here early. I got here the earliest because, I'm not going to lie, I was going like 80 or 90 at certain parts. 80 was like the bear. Like, that's the most I went, basically. But I went 90 at one part. Um, I was in the fast lane behind some other fast cars, like, not really, like, you know, Mustangs and stuff, but, like, cars that were going fast, so I was in the fast lane the whole time. It was good. Um, no problems at all. Um, yeah, there was no problems up here. It was actually really calm. Um, I'm not sure what's going to happen. I'm pretty sure they're going to come down. I'm pretty sure they're going to get here, instantly go to the pool area and start drinking. That's what they did last time. They made me fucking... This is how much they're going to drink. Let me... Oh, I can't turn the camera. 
They made me bring a goddamn, uh, a goddamn, uh, damn it, I hell just put the phone. They made me bring a goddamn cooler, because they're about to start drinking. I'm like, are you fucking serious, dude? Um, oh, fuck, what is there to talk about? I want to make a video, you know? I want to make videos like this, because I have to make videos like this for the next nine days, including today, so ten days. Um, got my Aperture Science lanyard. Uh, let's do a fucking what's on your keys, why not? Let's see, I got my No Known Jacuzzi Ray charm from an artist I follow on Tumblr. I found her, or I found her, uh, this product on Store Envy. Only one of these made, which makes it super special, because, you know, I love No Known Jacuzzi Ray, like, waifu status. And she only had one, I'm like, dude, I'm buying that shit instantly. So I bought it. Um, Kill a Kill Scissor Blade. Yeah, Scissor Blade. I was about to say Key Blade, I'm like, that's not right. Um, got House Key, a Lock Key to a Lock, I have no idea where it is. I've got my Volvo button thingy that, you know, locks or, or locks or unlocks the car. Uh, panic button, don't know what that yellow button does. I'm pretty sure that yellow button is like to stop the alarm or something. Lights is turned on. I need to look what that yellow button does. Uh, obviously my Volvo key and huge shout out to do it with Dan. I bought his, uh. Hashtag dickhead uh, motorcycle keychain. Love that thing. Um, so awkward. This old lady just came by and she's like, her car is like directly in front of me. And like she comes by and I saw her like in the rear view mirror. She looked at me and like gave me a weird look. Um, let's put this back down. But yeah, guys, um, I guess we're just going to wait. I have to wait till they get here. So I might turn my car on. Um, you know, got it on a clip system. But, uh, yeah, it was a really fun trip. I downloaded some new music, and it was really fun to listen to that while coming down here. Yeah, I decided to turn on my car because, um, it's hot. It's hot as hell right now. It is currently, well, 77 degrees out here. Out in Sacramento, back where I live in North Highlands, it was fucking, like, 105 when I left. Now it's 77. But, yeah, guys, um, I'll see you guys later when they get here. We're probably gonna go check out the room. Um, I'm not gonna do a video in the room. I'm gonna wait to see what happens for the rest of the night there. Seriously, probably just gonna drink. I'm probably gonna go play Pokemon Go right now, because that seems like fun. First, let me just hide my tablet. Because I always take my tablet with me when I go to places, so. Hide my tablet in the glove box, and yeah, we'll probably just see. They're probably gonna get drunk. If they decide to go get drunk, I'm gonna go to the room and I'm gonna record a video telling like, yeah, they're getting drunk. But um, yeah, I'll see you guys in a second. So hopefully my phone will allow me to um, piece it together. Uh, I'm probably about to pull out Pokemon Go and start fucking playing for real, cause I kind of want to see what type of Pokemon Vallejo has, and I'm I'm pretty positive Six Flags has a few um, Pokestops in it. So yeah, see you guys in a second. Bye. All right, so I'm assuming this is my cousin. Yep, it's my cousin and my sister. So yeah, it's my cousin. He's just pulled up. Um, fucking Six Flags is fucking lit with Pokemon. Uh, I'll be right back.